So I actually tried to record on my snowball microphone, but it's not working, so I'm just going to use my phone. Apparently, Zombie Kills has been found out to be a liar. Thanks, Lethal Lightning, for posting this video, and I know that I'm basically piggybacking off of you, but I covered her once before, and I don't really want to talk about what Lethal said. I just want to basically, you know, talk. Just let's have a talk. First off, for people who don't know, she made claims. I made a video about about this. She made claims that she got a free Xbox Series S, that, that Microsoft sent her one, and she tried to get Sony to send her a free PS5. Well, apparently, it turns out she actually got that uh, system. She actually got that system from uh, Target. <laughs> she paid full price for her system at Target. You know, like us plebs have to do whenever we want a new console. You know, I am the type of person who is very much under the impression that you, you pay for the things that you want unless you're a really successful person at whatever field that you do, and if a company feels like you are a good enough asset to them to give you a free copy of something, then good. Good, 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 good. But Zombie, here's the thing. You aren't that special. The most special thing you've ever done was you became a Twitch partner. Okay. Other than that, what are you? Why do we care? We don't. And now, when black people have called you out on this stuff, when black people called you out, you were like, well, it's just a shame that black people don't understand that I'm fighting for equality for them too. No, what you're doing is you're wanting to use your, your plight as a, as a black woman to get free stuff. It's not about equality. You don't care if other black people get to review stuff because here's the thing. Here's the thing. If some black guy, the YouTuber some black guy, was offered a free PlayStation 5 to review, and he got that review, you would, you would still make the same complaint and say, well, there needs to be more black reviewers. There needs to be more until you eventually got your own free console. That's exactly how people like you think. It's the same dang thing. It's how you work. So you don't care about the equality and the representation of the black man. No. You just care that you have to actually fork over 600 bucks for a system. Uh, maybe if you can't afford this crap, don't get into this profession. You see, I'm very happy with my Switch. Very happy with this. I like it a lot. If Nintendo was to send me a N Nintendo Switch Live Lite for free, okay, I'd be grateful. I wouldn't dare call Nintendo out and be like, well, you're racist because you're not giving a little nobody like me something. And okay, cool, you wrote for some publication that nobody's heard of. Bully for you. Bully for you, dude. Congratulations, you did it. You, you wrote for something... A million people have done that. You're not special. You gave a couple reviews of some stuff that people haven't heard of. And, and you want to you wanna think that, oh, because this woman wrote for a publication that we've never heard of, we have to give her a free console. Now, that's not how it works. Stop using racism. Stop you stoking fuel to the fire with the tensions in the United States alone with race issues as it is. Stop trying to use it to get free crap. You want to know why people don't take the Black Lives Matter movement seriously? Myself included? It's because you and people like you take it. And you'll run with it to be able to get free stuff. You're like, well, if you don't give me free shit, you're, you're racist. That's not how it works. You're not racist for wanting to have some free... You're not racist for not wanting to give somebody free stuff. I'm sick of it. I'm just sick of it. But it's funny, too. I'm not seriously pissed off by this. Um, I am disgusted by it, but I find it funny. You know, because it is, it's a sad, it's a sad black woman trying to get free stuff. 
fulfilling every stereotype that the rest of the world thinks about, you know, low income black folk. I don't know your income, but it's you're, you're fulfilling every stereotype. But guys, that's all I have to say about this. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you didn't like it, hit the dislike button. Comment down below telling me what you think. Like and sub like and share and subscribe and all that other good stuff. Because it tells the algorithm that you like what you saw. This is Gabe of Happy Blobfish Productions signing off, saying take care and God bless. Peace out, everybody. Soda,